and now go back. Bring it back. I'm giving resistance against it. I'm doing what the athletic trainer would do for 20 minutes, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm only going to do it four times, five times, because I've activated the muscle, I got the muscle going. Okay? Now there's one other key to this. You will find a spinal problem at the innervation of the muscle that wasn't working. Okay? So you can go back there and look in the spine, get in there at C5, look for a problem, and nine times out of ten you're going to find it. Rotate it back. Okay, now, push up, push up. Because you fix it doesn't mean it's going to work. And you can't trust that the patient's going to walk out of your office and make it work. So I have a person do that at home, or I have them take a very light weight. So in the treatment room, I've got two, three, five pound weights. And I say to them, okay, you're going to do this with the weight and pull it back. And you're going to do it in the morning after you've done this. And the patient does that, I give them a handout on it, and they do that for the next seven days. Now I've freed it up. i got it going. I've got them activating, making sure the muscle firing sequence starts to work. Now, go ahead and do that on your partner, and then do the other person. Okay? 